So question four, we'd, we thought we'd ask something that's slightly more obscure. academic, technical, no, obscure. Yeah. The question academic is, if you wish. a long straw is tossed at random onto a circle. Given that it falls so that it intersects the circle, what is the probability that the chord first defined is longer than a side of the inscribed equilateral triangle? And the correct answer is, depending on which aspect of a chord's uniform probability density is applied, the result can be proven to be either a half, a third, a quarter, or two minus root three over two. Good luck. Good luck. Six three three six and one one eight one one eight. I have utter faith in their knowledge. Possible exception of Lilo and Stitch. I don't think. <gasps> <laughs> Six three three six is refunded. One third. Take it. The answer is one third. Taking a tangent at the intersection, the straw could be from naught to one hundred and eighty degrees to it. Only between sixty and one hundred and twenty would the chord be longer. I think that's a reasonable attempt yeah, to answer, yeah. considering it's a computer. But no, it's not a computer. There are there are people actually. Oh. People sitting down answering these questions. Oh. So <sighs> that'd be such a sweet job. Only if the method of random selection is specified will this have a well-defined solution. There is no you there is no unique selection method, so is there is no unique solution. <laughs> correct! No! What? what? That's correct! Why? That's not what you've got written down. That's pretty much what I've got Why? written down. It it it, it depends it, they've they've said the method if there is no unique selection method, so there's no unique solution. Now I've said it depends on which aspect of the cause uniform probability does is applied. Which is basically the same thing. No, because for the, I, mine has given answers, has given the result it can be proven to be, and then it's given some. Mine's given that. Yeah, but it, and it's also uh, could be one hundred and eighty, and only two options could not be. What? Because like they're saying, oh, it could be anything, but only these two could it not be? Because the thing would be longer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, oh, this was clearly a mistake. <laughs> I'm just saying, I think my answer is equally as valid. We'll, we'll, we'll award one point to both services, I reckon. Okay. I, 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 I'm, I'm prouder of 118118's answer. I think that's, that's fine. Well, I don't correct. understand the question, yeah. so I'm not. But prompt! Prompt Fair, with an answer, they true, were probably true, there true. burrowing away. One point to each, so after four questions, it's four points to 6336 and four points to 118118. It is a nail biter. It's like the Oxford Cambridge boat race all over again. <laughs>